with McClatt at third base, and Adams got it done. Line drive left field, catch made by Willie Fox. McClatt will tag and score. And Virginia on the scoreboard. Cavs have cut the Demon Deacon lead in half. Sacrifice fly RBI, and Greg McClatt manufactures the run. And there's a line drive to the right side on two hops. Backhanded by Adams, so a pump and throw. And there are two men down. Bar swings and rockets one that way. It's in the corner. One run home, two runs home, all the way to the wall. And John Barr, a stand-up double, puts Virginia in front three to two. Playing the flat well off the line and left. He goes the other way and rifles a base hit to right. They're going to wave the base runner in and slipping and falling Ogletree. It allows the run to score. It's 4-2 Virginia and an RBI base hit off the bat of Greg McClatt. Two out. And here's Swimmer's pitch. It's lined to left. This should hang up. Ranging back John Barr. He'll put it away and book this one to Virginia. The Cavs take game one. That one ripped to right field and fairly deep. Playable for Jarrett Parker to make the catch. This will get the run home. Parker catches in front of the V Sabres in right center field. Tagging and scoring Mike Murray in Wake Forest. Grabs a 1-0 early lead. David Coleman first pitch swinging. Rips one to right down the line. A fair ball. Extra bases. Cruising into score is Dan Grovat. Coleman to second. Standing up. An RBI two-out double from David Coleman. Has tied the game 1-1. We show great resiliency today. It can be frustrating at times um, early in the ball game when you don't push runs across, but hitting is a very challenging thing to do, you know. But what's important is that we rose up when our you know when we needed guys the most. Not punting and instead bounces one through the right side of the infield into right for a base hit. They're gonna wave the runner around. The throw to the plates online, the slide in time. Now this scores Virginia ties the game. Andrew Carraway was uh, tremendous at the start of the game. Packer came in and done, did a nice job to give the ball to Swimmer, and that's Swimmer's longest outing of the year. Here's Swimmer's 1-2. Check swing went too far. Valdez will have to throw to first to complete the strikeout. He does, and the inning's over. You know, I've been prepared for this. You know, I've got longer outings. I, I was In the summer, I started, so I mean, I'm prepared to go to go as long as it takes to get our team in, team in W. And here's the 2-1. Ground ball to the right side. Adams has a chance. Second for one. McClatt to first. Double play. And Valdez rips one down the right field line. Fair ball into the corner. Valdez will wheel around first and dig for second. He's there standing up. A two-base hit leading off for Valdez in the bottom of the 11th inning. It feels great to, to get that done, especially I've been struggling a little bit. But it's definitely up, up to the team. John Barr got the button down. Gary Parker got it done. So it's not just me. It's the whole team got it together to get that win. Today, David Coleman had a couple of big hits. Jarrett Parker, you know, had the game-winning uh, RBI. You know, it's uh, Franco Valdez's double at the beginning of the inning. And that's what being on a team is all about, that, um, you know, they pick each other up and uh, different guys on different days do the job. Infield draws in, first pitch, golf to left! That'll do it! Willie Fox makes the catch over the shoulder, tagging and scoring Corey Hunt, and book this one to Virginia. I'm just so proud of our team, uh, how we came back and picked each other up. That's what it's about. I think that that win right there is going to serve our team well going down the stretch.